pilot started to fly last Monday in a parking lot. One of the shopkeepers is nearly hit, nearly caught right in the crossfire. Listen to his scary story. We would have been in that parking lot, but I had to get something out of my office, and um, it, we just missed it because definitely we would have gotten hit in the crossfire. Dominic talking about the latest violence to strike Melrose Ave. This time, it's a shootout in broad daylight. Two would-be armed robbers get out of this Dodge Avenger, targeting the shoppers who are standing in a parking lot. But one of the shoppers pulls out a gun of his own and starts firing, fighting back. Bullets fly. The Dodge takes off, and the two robbers run away. This new security video shows them running, no limping Stop. away. Stop Both the shot in their Stop legs, the leaving a trail oh, no. of blood. Run away. Oh, this no, new security that's... video shows Boom. them. Stop right there. Do you notice? Stop right there. All right. Before we get into this story, I'm going to talk about the story and the robbery in a minute. But first, did you notice the Bitcoin sign right there? They got the Bitcoin. You got that crypto is there. Now, you know, I got to bring that up because at Hustle Headquarters, we, prime, we talk about investing in yourself. We talk about the power of cryptocurrency every single day. And it's looking like this was a store. They probably had a Bitcoin ATM. This is right on Melrose Avenue um, in Los Angeles, California. Um, lots of money here. And I'm going to talk about this Bitcoin crypto in a, in a little bit. All right. So first, welcome uh, to Hustle Headquarters. Congratulations for being alive today. You made it. And even better, the fact that you're studying and looking to invest in your own success by showing up 50 percent of the work is already done just by you being here preparing yourself right so what a situation where the robbers they were not ready for their victim to be ready the the the, the they end up becoming the victim and so this is when we talk a lot about just preparing yourself for almost anything in any situation right we got to prepare ourselves and so as you see he was ready for any situation well not any but he was he was definitely prepared and he had his own weapon available and he was ready to shoot now a couple things i, I want to know i want to talk about before i go into the crypto talk and the wealth talk so first before we go into that let's look at the state of the world that we're in right now okay these two guys here are out on parole. All right, so they just got out of jail. This is what they said in the news article towards the end. So I ask myself, when we're living in a world with such high um, unemployment, there's not a lot of jobs that are available for a person, especially if you're unskilled. And so you got to think, you got these guys, let's say they've been in jail and now when you're away, you come back out, you probably don't have any hard labor skills, which is important that we have, that we teach people and we have some type of apprenticeships where people can learn trades. So they probably don't have any trade skills. They can't work with their hands, okay? Uh, two, they probably can't easily get a job that's paying decent enough because these guys probably don't have the skill. Remember, over, over 25 million Americans cannot read above a sixth grade level so it's a lot of people that don't even get into cryptocurrencies because they don't even understand basics of how to read and with that people get intimidated they're afraid to learn about crypto or any type of other investment because in their mind they're intimidated they don't know what to do not trying to make excuses for these guys because i like i don't respect people trying to rob and take somebody else that's been working hard i'm simply saying this to say you got to understand we're living in a time where a lot of people are hungry and they don't know how to eat. And so this is just the beginning, right? Meaning we'll, we'll, we'll potentially start seeing all types of folks doing desperate things. You know, in New York, they just made prostitution legal. What it is, it's not totally legal, but they're in the process of working on that. Uh, that's a sign because you got a lot of people not paying rent. New York is like a huge exodus right now of uh of money is leaving and same thing with places like california because the taxes are so high so we're in a changing world and it is falling apart and people are desperate and then on top of that you got food shortages 
uh, coming up, um, supply shortages, and you got people that are totally afraid and all out anarchy. All right. A lot of this stuff was already happening when we saw Trump in office. And now people think because you got this new Democrat guy in office that things are going to change. No, things are going to can not only continue to go in this route, but they're going to get worse because now the Democrat person is going to make you think that they're on your side when really they're not. So you got to realize your back is against the wall and you got to act like it. I don't care if you got a million dollars, you still cannot outwork inflation. Okay. If, if you, if you're an average person, guess what? You can't outwork uh, automation. Right. If you like the work and if you're a person that's black, you can't outwork immigration because now you got people coming in and working for cheaper laborers and using immigrants taking over. By the way, make sure that you get that book. Uh, Shut up and hustle. Think like an immigrant as well. Get that book Buy five of them. Give them away to some powerful friends. Remember, uh, leaders are readers and a great gift starts when you can uh, enrich other people's lives. So make that be a gift you give out. Contribute to the channel. But I wanted to also, what made me really even want to talk about this video is one, it was the fact that that Bitcoin sign was there. Because I want you to know cryptocurrency is unstoppable. Um, it can be slowed down, but it cannot be stopped with the nature of the crypto. So it's taken over. So why not learn about it? You can learn about that stuff here. We talk about that. We talk about XRP, HEX, um, which you can get involved in, which is you can use like a long-term and uh, short-term retirement planning and automatic making your money like a money printer. We show you how guys how to do this stuff here. Uh, but this stuff is important too because once you get value and you make money, you got to protect it. You got to walk around the world sometimes, especially in these inner cities like this. Walk around and act like you got $50,000 in cash in the bag. Because when you do that, your, your mindset is, I need to be ready because somebody could try to attack me. And it's sometimes it's good because it's going to put you in a position, well, look at this guy. If he wasn't ready and he didn't have his weapon, not only could he potentially be dead, but also the two women here could have been dead as well. Okay? So it's sometimes... You know, women many times don't understand the danger that they're in. You got a lot of women that are honestly teach, treating the, the world like everything is sweet. And they're going on vacations and they're not thinking about the, the fear and the fact that the economy is collapsing. But you as a man, if you're a man watching this, you got to be prepared. You got to always uh, have some type of um, not just preparation by having a gun, but we're talking about mentally, physically, spiritually, socially, emotionally, all of those things. You want to have a relationship with God. You want to walk at your house knowing that this could be, you know, a, a time where I need to be armored up. You need to have a relationship with socially. You got to know how to meet new people, right? You got to know how to, not only that, but how to communicate with people. Because one of the biggest reasons why most people have conflict is because they can't communicate well. These two guys here that are robbing, trying to attempting to rob this guy, they had a communication issues. They most likely, I can damn near guarantee you, these guys are not good communicators. I mean, because if you if you can if you got a mouthpiece and you know how to sell and you know how to connect with people and establish relationships, there's no need to rob anybody because people will just want to give you their money just because you're a good communicator and people are gonna want to buy into whatever you do. Right. That's when you're an influencer and you're a connector. So you got to grow those communication skills, guys. You get and we talk about that here. Uh, you, you got we talk about how to establish relationships, how to connect. We talk about that. Extremely important. And they probably came from a family in a neighborhood where people didn't value becoming a great communicator that much and connecting with people. You see, too many of us have this attitude where we think we're just trying to be independent of each other. And, and, and so we don't, because we don't know how to communicate. So we, we, we get jealous of each other. We hate on another YouTuber or you hate on somebody that you think is doing better than you, or you think they're competition because you don't know how to talk to them and communicate in a way to connect to say, you know what? I respect what you're doing. Can we work together? And because you don't know how to properly communicate that, or you don't have the mindset to do that, then you go into thinking you're independent and everybody wants to compete. I'm going to take his money. So, um, so he was prepared. These two guys got hit in the leg, unfortunately. Um, I don't want to keep playing this video 
because personally I don't like showing uh I don't like looking at black folks uh doing things like that to each other. And let's be real, these three guys probably have a tremendous amount of potential. Um these guys, if they were to get the same energy and target it a different way, meaning focus it a different way, uh, if, because they got more support from another brother or more encouragement from family members in the community. I mean, you'd be amazed what can happen when people have support, when people get positive validation. So I'm pretty sure these guys are, uh, they come from good stock. These gentlemen probably have very, because it takes, because let's be real, to rob somebody, gunpoint, it takes courage. You got to have some balls to do that because anything could happen. You could get killed in the process. So these guys are, they're, they're brave. They're not the smartest dudes in the world, but they're brave. And so we, we just got to really begin to support each other and, and, and build each other up, especially the young men. Cause what if they were taking this same energy and they were being programmed to be empowered and to then develop skills where they can put this into a trade, building, you know, doing contracting work or doing some type of welding work or electric, electric, electricity work or developing technology. So, you know, I uh, want to just say, we, we, you know, we got to continue to build our community. You got to understand just because you may have some money, you're not successful if the rest of your community is broke and broken. All right. So we judge our our level of success by the extent of our extended family and community. So with that being said, get that book series, shut up and hustle, support the channel, uh, hit that cash app below. And, uh, guys don't panic. Don't panic. If you are a young person and you thinking like, I don't know how to get this money. And I think I'm going to just take somebody else's money. That's panic because you don't want to have a long term consequence because you're in a short term messed up situation. Right. Because in places like crypto and places like real estate, guess what? You don't need a high school diploma to get money. You can be all self-taught. All right. Especially when, you know, when, when you're investing and you can learn all this stuff on the Internet and you can learn a lot of this stuff by subscribing to this channel. So so subscribe and uh, like and I'll see you in the next video.